So, uh, without further ado, we can begin uh, with Zach Gross. If you don't mind uh, taking the floor and we'll from there and speaking to you. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, so thank you very much for inviting me here. You said I could talk for as long as I wanted, so. <laughs> um, I think we seem like a fun group. We'll try to make this fun for everyone. Um, I graduated from Fairfield in 2012, along with Allie, and I majored in Spanish while I was here. And I kind of feel like I cheated in terms of my career path because I was involved with the not-for-profit organization that I currently work for, Simply Smiles since I was in high school, actually. And so I volunteered with them for a week in 2008 after I graduated high school, became an intern throughout my summers uh, when I was at Fairfield, and fortunately was offered a job once I graduated. But going on that experience to Mexico as a volunteer at our project locations down in Oaxaca in southern Mexico, it um, I guess it validated my decision to be a language major. I came in as an English major and a Spanish minor and flip-flopped those when I was here um, during my freshman year. I just thought that studying a language would be really fun and I already knew English pretty well, so I figured um, I should study something that I had a real passion for and that just really fascinated me. So. I loved my time when I was here. I had great professors. Um, the language department is really great here at Fairfield. I um, studied abroad in Nicaragua through the Fairfield program that um, we have with our sister university down there, UCA, and that was another wonderful experience. It really taught me a lot to just be comfortable in my own skin. I had never really been away from my family and friends for that period of time, um, especially taking courses in another language was a little intimidating for me. But all my classes were in Spanish. It was a great opportunity to be forced to speak a language. I had spent time in Mexico um, a few weeks over the summers practicing my Spanish, but really when I was in Nicaragua, I had to really practice my language skills and it taught me to just kind of go for things and not think as much about how people would judge me or it just really taught me how to be more self-confident. Um, it was also a lot of fun. So I would encourage you all um, to study abroad and consider the program in Nicaragua um, especially. Currently, during my job at Simply Smiles, I do a lot. My title is senior program manager. That is just a catch-all term that means that I do a lot of things. I, if you read my, <laughs> um, that's usually how manager, managerial positions go. Um, you can read in my bio that uh, I have been trained in how to test fecal samples. Um, it's not something I expected to do after I graduated, but we do medical clinics down in southern Mexico. So that's something that I learned. Uh, I now have my bus driver's license because we drive a bus out to South Dakota on the Native American reservation where we work. Uh, I just do a lot of diverse things, not things that I were necessarily thinking about when I was studying at Fairfield. But I think the curriculum here, and especially in the modern language department, just made me a more well-rounded person, someone who was able to uh, more ably think on their feet and just kind of, I don't know, just have fun. <laughs> so uh, that is it for now, I think, but I will pass it along to Allie.